it's Masala here. Today I'm going to show you how to make these beautiful crystal egg geodes that we made. Look how neat they look. I'm just amazed how beautiful they turned out. So before I get started, I was going to talk about the eggshells that you'll be using. You can use the ones that you use to cook with that are cracked in half, but if you'd like the oblong shape, you'd have to blow the contents of your egg and cut the shells carefully lengthwise in half. So I'll show you how to blow your egg and cut it carefully and then we'll go over the step-by-step -step process. Thanks for watching and I hope that you enjoyed the video. To blow out an egg, you'll need a push pin or a tack. You're going to poke holes on the top and the bottom of the egg. You kind of want to work it in there so you can open up the membrane. Get another hole in there. Carefully take your scissors, slowly and carefully cut the shell. Our eggshells are now clean and dried, and I did take out the membrane, but you don't have to. So we're going to put a couple of drops of school glue. Make sure you use your paintbrush to spread the glue throughout the interior of the shell. Once you're finished applying the glue into the interior of your eggshells, go ahead and sprinkle some alum generously. You want to make sure that the edges are covered with the alum powder. The alum powder adhered into the interior of the eggshells will help with the crystal formation. Let these dry overnight before combining it with the alum water and food color mixture. For the solution, you will need two cups of very hot water. You're going to combine that with 3 4 cup of aluminum sulfate. We're going to stir this to dissolve it. You're also going to add about 30 drops of food color. Stir your solution until the alum dissolves. Our mixture has cooled for about 30 minutes. We're going to go ahead and pour them in the cups. Divide them evenly into the two cups. Place your prepared eggshells into the cups. You have to use a spoon to push them down to the bottom gently. Now we wait 12 to 15 hours for our crystals to form. Drain some of the excess liquid in there. Oh, they turn out great. We'll just let it dry in a paper towel. Right here? Yeah. 